guys, today I will be showing you how to make these awesome Frozen and Shopkin themed snow globes. I did a Frozen for you one, I did a Frozen 2, well hopefully a Frozen 2 <laughs> wedding scene one, and I did Elsa and her Shopkin's Frozen Buddies. <laughs> um, so what you will need is this paint your own glitter dome, you don't actually have to use this, um, you can buy your own DIY snow globe or use like a jar or anything you want but I found these are really easy and straightforward um, and they've got the, the themes of what I wanted to do with Anna, Elsa and Ola um, so yeah, I, I did not use any of these figures I used my own figures and you could also use your own figures at home you don't necessarily need to do an Anna or an Elsa theme you could do a My Little Pony scene, you could do a Disney princess, you could put whatever you want as long as you've got the figurines. So you just glue down your figurines and create your scene. Okay, so to recreate the Frozen Fever scene, um, I'll be using the Olaf, the Olaf um, dome. I will take that out of the packaging and I'll also be using an Olaf Mystery Mini. And I kind of smeared some glue on his mouth because he likes to eat Anna's cake. Um, and I will be using some green felt and birthday Betty. I could always use this cake in the snow globe, but. I wanted to create something that you could do at home. Um, if you were to use this cake, you'd have to get this whole set, and that's not always possible. The great thing is, I'm sure you have some Shopkin duplicates that you can make scenes out of, which is awesome. The last thing I will be using is this Arna figure. Um, it's a standard Coronation Arna figure. I'm sure you've seen it before. Um, I just customized it. So I'm going to open up the dome and and start placing all the figures inside. Okay, so I added more water and a bit more glitter. <laughs> Shake it up a bit. So the next snow globe I'm going to put together is the Frozen 2 scene. Um, now, any Frozen fan has got all kinds of theories about what will happen in Frozen 2. And I am hoping <laughs> there will be a wedding. Frozen 2 and I think it will be at the beginning of the movie um, because it probably will give them an opportunity to introduce a new character, good or bad, probably bad, <laughs> into the, the storyline and um, so I'm just gonna put this together while I talk about my theories, my Frozen 2 theories. So I just painted an Anna figure, same with um, Kristoff, I just painted them white and I added Wendy wedding cake naturally <laughs> to the wedding scene and now and I've glued those on um, obviously I took out the on a figure that was in there and I also took out the clay block so I'm just gonna put the lid on and I'm gonna fill it up with water and glittering and some glitter so what I think will happen in Frozen 2 I think Anna went through so much in the first Frozen but I don't think they'd take that away from her, the wedding thing. I don't know, I feel like... Well, I'm hoping they don't. <laughs> I also think that in the first Frozen, there was a character that we thought was good and then it ended up being bad, which was Hans. I think they might do the opposite this time. Maybe introduce a character that we think is going to be bad and they turn out to be good, maybe? So I don't the second know. thing that I think will happen in Frozen 2, well, I'm hoping will happen in Frozen 2 is that they're gonna go back in time and 
look into their parents' past. I think in the first Frozen, their mum barely had much to say. But the looks that she gave Elsa and the sadness and story in her eyes told so much. So I think Frozen 2 will give us a closer look into their parents' story and might answer a few questions as to why Elsa has ice powers in the first place. Okay, so the last snow globe scene I am going to put together is a Disney Frozen and Shopkins Frozen. <laughs> I thought they would be really cute together as a snow globe. So I got some of the season one Shopkins, Cool Cube and Popsicle, and um, obviously Olaf and Elsa playing with a snowball. And I thought that would be a really cute snow globe to create. So I probably know how this works. Um, I stuck them down with glue. They're not going anywhere. <laughs> and there's the scene. So I will put the lid on and fill it up with uh, water and some glycerin and some glitter. some of the glitter they gave us in the pack, in the box. Alright guys, I really hope you like these snow globes. I had a lot of fun making them. <laughs> Please give this video a big thumbs up if you did. And let me know what you think will happen in Frozen 2. I mean, I've got so many theories, <laughs> but whatever they put in Frozen 2, I know it will be amazing. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Take care, bye!